Hi, here I got some request to solve this problem. Here it says the latitude is 6 degree north and longitude is 079 degree west. And final latitude is given B is 38 degree south and longitude B is 179 degree east. Find the uh, distance uh, initial course and final course and also he wants to know with the diagram so no problem let me write the initial latitude a here which is six degree north and longitude zero seven nine degree west now let me write b which is 38 degree south and this is 179 degree west this is the longitude so let's write d lat although we don't need to calculate d lat but uh, we need to know the direction so from north you are going south so this direction is south now okay i think i made a little mistake here this is uh, not uh, west rather oh uh, this i am not able to no problem this is actually east okay now it is corrected this is east so uh, from west to east so let me write here d long d long is uh, 170 uh, sorry 79 degree west to 179 degree so it is i get 258 degree east but we know the value of d long cannot be more than uh, 180 degrees so i subtract this from 360 degree so minus 360 so i get 102 degree now the value of east will become west that is the catch here now let's draw the diagram and if we see here suppose this is the equator and a is and the direction is going to be south and west south and west this direction so suppose a is here a is here which is six degree north so this is equator so this value is six degree and uh, b is 38 degree south so b is let me just scratch it up uh, stretch it up 38 degree south 38 degrees south somewhere here b is somewhere here and the value is uh, 38 degrees south well and so let's let me draw the diagram here uh, this is north pole so it will curve towards north and here it is south pole so it will curve towards south now we see that uh, uh, the value of uh, southern latitude is high so we'll take pole here in the southern hemisphere although it will, should not make any difference and then i draw the triangle like this so here i think just uh, let's scroll it up a little bit six degree north so pa becomes 96 degree similarly this one is this one is 38 so okay 38 minus 90 gives you 52 so this is 52 degree and this angle i have already obtained that is your d long which is 102 degree now all you have to do just use a cosine formula and cosine formula says that cos of AB, cosine of AB is equal to cos of PA and cos of PB. Plus, I don't have a space so I can write here, sine of PA, sine of PB into cos P. And all the values are given here. PA is given. PB is given and angle P is also given. So let me just put these values here. So cos PA cos 96 
into cos PB cos 52 is equal to this. This is minus plus back at the start sin uh, PA and sin 96 into sin 52 into cos of 102 bracket close so I get some value which is in minus and then I shift and then I shift cos inwards and I get this value so I get AB as 103.13768 whatever I can round off to 103.138 degree and uh, if I multiply it by 60, I get this value as 6188.26266 or round off 6188.3 nautical mile. That is the answer. That is the distance. Now, we need to find what is this angle. What is this angle A? So, again, uh, we have obtained this value and let me write here AB 103.138 just to be more accurate and then again I am going to use this cosine formula here. So, this how I am going to use now <coughs> cosine of PB cos of PB is equal to cos of AB into cos of uh, PA plus sine of AB into sine of PA into cos of A. So this will give me cos A. Cos A is uh, cos of PB minus cosine of AB cosine of PA divided by sine of AB and sine of PA. So all I have to do now just enter the values. So PA. So let's, let's start with cos of uh, PB cos 52 minus uh, bracket start cos of uh, AB cos of AB is 103.138 into cos of PA which is uh, 96 bracket close is equal to this divided by again bracket to start sine of PAB 103.138 into sine of PA into sine of PA sine of PA is, is uh, sine 96 bracket close so I get this value 0 0.661 whatever and then cos inverse directly I get this value A is equal to 52.326 well I can round off to 50 <coughs> sorry just a minute 50. I can round off to 52.3 degree and if we see the course is going to be uh, this is south and west direction because uh, my delet is south and the long is west so uh, the course will be southwest okay so it's pretty simple straightforward if it is southwest and uh, this is north this is south this is east and this is west my ship is somewhere here actually we I have obtained this value so uh, a ship is heading this direction all I have to do just find this angle so this is going to be 180 sorry 180 plus uh, 52.3 uh, is equal to 232.3 degree true that is the initial course this is initial course now there should not be any problem in finding the final course the final course 
all you have to do here i think you can do it here also like instead of cos a you need to find cos b now cos b we just need to change excuse me cos uh, p a minus cos of a b and cos of p a instead of p a just write p b divided by sin of a b and sin of p a instead of p a you write p b so let's start solving here cos of p a p a cos of p a is 96 minus back to start cos of a b which is 103.138 into cos of p b which is cos of 52 bracket close divided by again bracket start sign of a b which is 103.138 yeah also bit cold and sign of 96 sine of 96 which that is pb bracket close i gets this value and then shift and cos inverse so i hope you get this value which is 87.9 degree 87.9 degree now we obtain only this value which is 87.9 degree and how to convert into the course well the ship is like this ship is in this direction and the angle obtained is from this south line southwest and the angle obtained is 87 which is 87.91 so what is this angle this angle is to be minus 180 degree so yeah that's uh you need to be careful okay this is uh, 92.1 this has to be 92.1 degree now if it is 92.1 what is the angle from here it is 92.1 plus 180 degree so 92.1 plus 180 degree how much you get 272 to 72.1 degree or simply minus 360 degree you can say or you can say 87.9 north and west i hope this answers your problem you got to be very careful for finding the final goals